Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem thirty-six in chapter twenty-one. Chapter twenty-one is about uh, electric charge and electric field. So there you can see we have a two-point charge Q1 and Q2. The distance is L zero point one two meter, right? And then we find the, there is a point P. So we find the, at the position P, the electric field is zero. So now question ask you the distance between P and Q1. So we need to find the quantity X. Now we can see for this question, Q1 carry negative charge, Q2 carry positive charge. So the electric field produced by the Q1 is radically inward, right? It should pointing to the negative charge. Agree? So it is E1 look like this way. And if we write down the magnitude for E1 is T, Q1 x squared, because the distance between P and Q1 is x, right? And then now we look at the charge Q2. And for this charge, it is carries a positive charge. So electric field will move outward. Just uh, move outward. So E2 polarization uh, pointing to the negative x direction. If we write down the magnitude for the E2, it should equal to K, Q2. And the, the distance between P and Q2 is x plus L. Agree? Yes. Now, tell us the electric field at this position P is zero. So that means the E1, vector E1 plus vector E2 equals to zero. And we can see these two vectors are the opposite direction. So this vector can be zero. Just lead the magnitude equals E1 equals to E2, magnitude of electric field equals, right? So we can write down the E1 magnitude equals to E2 magnitude and solve this equation. See, we get the function for x and then input the known quantities L, Q1, Q2, get the answer there. Thank you.